Meghan stuns in double denim as she consoles Prince Harry after polo loss. The Duke of Sussex is an avid polo player. Meghan played the role of supportive wife on Friday as she cheered on Prince Harry in his latest polo match. The Duchess of Sussex looked some ready in double denim, rocking a pair of shorts and a matching shirt, which she teamed with Grecian-style leather sandals, a jumper worn tied across the shoulders, and some designer sunglasses. Meghan was animatedly cheering Harry on from the sidelines of the Santa Barbara Polo and Racquet Club, and was later seen consoling her husband after his team, Lowe's Padres, were sadly beaten in their league final. Harry joined the team in May and has spent the last few weeks playing alongside his teammates, which includes his close friend Nacho Figueras, a professional polo player who founded Lowe's Padres. Last month, Nacho shared his delight at being reunited with Harry at a match and shared a photo of their special time together on Instagram. He wrote, Thrilled to be riding alongside my friend, Prince Harry. And the rest of the Lowe's Padres team at the at Santa Barbara Polo Club's Harry East Memorial Tournament. We've ridden together many times over the years and now that we're both parents, it's extra special to be able to spend this time together. He added, the name Los Padres was inspired by the proximity of the field to the Los Padres National Forest and also by our connection as fathers. Harry and Nacho have been friends for over 13 years and bonded over their shared love of sport and philanthropy. Of course, I think the fact that we both feel the same way about giving back obviously helps you to have a good relationship, he previously told Insider. Meghan and Harry did it to venture far for their day out as the club is close to their home in Montecito, where they live with their two children, Archie, three, and one-year-old daughter Lilibet. Meghan was cheering her husband on from the sidelines of the polo field on Friday, as Prince Harry's team battled in vain for a place in their league final. Casually dressed in a denim shirt and shorts, with flat Grecian-style leather sandals, the Duchess of Sussex watched the match intently. She appeared animated as she followed the game, lemonade in hand. The prince joined the Lowe's Padres polo team in May under the name Harry Wales, and has spent the last few weeks playing alongside his teammates. The team, which competes in the Pacific Coast Circuit into Circuit Cup, was founded by Nacho Figueres an Argentine polo professional and model, and longtime friend of the Prince. It came as friend revealed last night how Prince William is still at rock bottom over the fractured bond with his brother. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are proud parents to children Archie and Lilibet. Prince Harry and Meghan recently celebrated a major milestone when daughter Lilibet Diana turned one during the Queen's Platinum Jubilee. The Sussexes, who are also parents to three-year-old son Archie, are currently raising their beloved children. At their Montecito home in California, which boasts plenty of space for a growing family, many royal fans will be wondering if the Duke and Duchess will follow in the footsteps of Harry's older brother Prince William, and try for a third baby but what have the Duke and Duchess of Sussex said about having a third baby? However, Noting that Harry has previously expressed his desire to help the environment by limiting the number of children he has. Back in July 2019, the son of Prince Charles interviewed Dr. Jane Goodall for Vogue magazine and said, I think, weirdly, because of the people that I've met and the places that I've been fortunate enough to go to, I've always had a connection and a love for nature. I view it differently now, without question. But I've always wanted to try and ensure that even be for having a child and hoping to have children. Jane them replied, laughing, not too many. About the size of his brood. The prince assured her, too, maximum. But I've always thought, this place is borrowed. And, surely, being as intelligent as we all are, or as evolved as we all are supposed to be, we should be able to leave something better behind for the next generation. So, if Harry is still of the same view, and if Meghan is on the same page as her husband, we won't be seeing any more Sussex babies in the future. Harry's cousin Zara Tyndall also welcomed a baby in 2021, her third child Lucas Philip. And her husband Mike revealed how their family is now complete too. Speaking on the good, the bad and the rugby podcast after Lucas' birth, Mike told listeners how he felt after his new son arrived. He revealed, I literally was like yep, snip, snip. Snip I've got a boy. I'm out. I'm out of here. Harry and Meghan shared news of Lilibet's arrival on their website, writing. On the 4th of June, 
We were blessed with the arrival of our daughter, Lily. She is more than we could have ever imagined. And we remain grateful for the love and prayers we've felt from across the globe. Thank you for your continued kindness and support during this very special time for our family. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, would you please help us like, share and subscribe our channel. Wish you happy to see our videos. Thank you very much.